up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. Today I am going to be showing you guys how to make your own kit PvP server within about 9 or 10 episodes which will probably be like about 2 hours or so. Um, but yeah, it, it is really simple. All you need is a server. You can get one for free which with limited plugins on um, minehut.com and there's plugins on there in which you can actually make your own kit PvP uh, server but um, I'm gonna be using wolf hosting if you want to buy um, a Minecraft an actual Minecraft server with like the FTP and um, the ser like the console and all that so I'm using one gigabyte which is only a dollar fifty a month and it is simple um, but yeah in this series I'm gonna be showing you guys how to actually build a spawn well that my friend will probably do that his name is tricks he's actually in in um, He's actually in the server at the minute, and uh, yeah, we'll be I'll be setting up all the ranks, even by craft if you want, even um, even by craft, even engine, which is a site, and uh, yeah, let's hope for the best. So first of all, what you want to do is buy yourself a server, and uh, yeah, go to the FTP, go to plugins. Now, all the plugins that I have at the minute is essentials. Custom Gapple, which I'm probably going to delete. Lore attri attri attributes recorded, recorded. Multiverse permissions X, plugin metrics, uh, Vault Vox Sniper, World Edit World Guard, and then custom kits also. Um, now I've just realised that you can't actually um, you can't actually edit them, but still they're pretty cool. Like custom kits, you can download it and just upload it to your plugins. Just click upload and choose file it's really simple and uh, yeah I'll have all the plugin links in the description if you want to check it out um, but yeah what you need to do is what you need to do is you need to do slash slash <laughs> slash <laughs> you need to slash archer to get the archer kit and it clears your inventory so it's pretty cool you get the um, there's abilities as well you get um, protection one and all that bow five it's, it's pretty cool and then you can do um, what is it slash falcon yeah and slash falcon gives you some custom uh, boots they're pretty cool custom names and all that falcon has a ability to punch people for far back that's pretty cool um, and swiftness potions as well now there is permissions in which they're easy to set up so we'll do that in the next video um, we're just I'm just gonna be showing you guys how to actually like set up the permissions let's check out slash scorcher and scorcher is just as you can see just a scorcher um, it, what, what, what is this if to shoot fire that's pretty cool and yes that is really cool um, so this could be like a donator rank or something um, slash viper let's see what this does viper eye Whoa, yeah, that's pretty cool. So it, it poisons people, it launches uh, poison, there is um, protection, fire, or regeneration. That's really cool. And then you have the wither, and uh, let's just check this out. Let's just see what it actually does. Wither, sir. Whoa. Whoa, that, that's, that's really cool, man. Whoa. It can shoot wither skulls. Yes, that is insane. But yeah, like like I just showed you, there is abilities and there is custom kits, and uh, hopefully you'll be able to edit them in the future. Maybe the developer might um might let you edit them, you know. And uh, yeah, so what we are what we are going to do next is we are going to do um we're actually going to sort out the some ranks so what you want to do is you want to download permissions X go to your minecraft FTP go to permissions X and just give me a second let it load up and then you should it should be a config.yml and you well this is how I get like permissions to use um, hex what you do is do allow ops to put that to true save it and reload and um, yeah 
Let me just reload quickly. And I should have permission. What is that up there? That's a wild trick. Hello. How are you doing, my friend? Huh? How are you? I'm gonna throw a wither skull at you. Oh, sorry. Yeah, but um. Right. Do slash wither. Tricks? Are you here? You can unmute your mic, by the way. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do the rank. So, what you wanna do is slash pex group owner prefix and then you can make it random. So, I'm just gonna do it like this and then pex user keyenbergs group set owner. Nice. So, if I talk in chat, it'll say owner, but it doesn't have a space. So if you want to get rid of that, like, if you want to have a space, you can just do, you just go back, go into permission, plugins, permissions x, slash permission, permissions.y, um, uh, and it is really simple just to use and to do the permissions for it. So I can do like, um, I can just do like random, like this. And then my name can be like <coughs> that. So if I save it and just type slash pex reload, it should work. Yeah, as you can see, my name my name is well, it isn't orange because I'm up. So if I de up myself, it'll be orange like that. Um, tricks, could you up me? Yep. Right. Yep. But uh, yeah, it, it's just really simple to use. You can also give um members or default people so when they join like tricks say if i do slash pex group default and then prefix well like well i make uh you can make it like gold or green or whatever i don't really care i know i'll do it like this because this looks pretty cool so yeah um talk there yo hey yeah you are you are the warrior of the house now all i have to do next is just go back to permissions and give him a space you know for his name because why not um just to be nice you know because you know, <laughs> um you, you can you can in in the next episode i'm gonna be showing you guys how to give well how to give each other um sorry I'm just concentrating on this how, how to give each other permissions for what you want to use and uh yeah, this is episode one of the of the Kip PvP series on how to make a Kip PvP server. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.